Fox here and welcome back to my channel to the Cupcake Playlist. Today I am going to show you how to place 23 cupcakes to make the letter A pull apart cake. Okay, let's get started with the letter A. Now having a look at the template on the phone, this letter takes 23 cupcakes. And I'm going to start off by doing 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm going to start off by doing 7 up each side six in the middle, and then the three right below it. I'm starting right at the bottom now with the letters um, because it'll keep it even. <laughs> and that's really the only reason. Four, five, six, seven. So now we're going to work at the six on the top, and we're going to going to kind of offset, like shove it into the middle part. Like there's beside it and then they're shoving it into the middle. So these other ones we're just going to put beside. And I wasn't very careful with my planning it out, so I have to move them. It's always very, care very good to be careful when you're planning. All right, so there we go. We've got the letter A. Thanks so much for hanging out. I'll see you in the next letter. Okay, let's have a look at the letter B. Ta-da! So for this letter B, it takes 24 cupcakes, and I am going to start on the 6 down and the 6 block in the middle, and then we'll do our around the loops from there. Let's have a look. So there's the 6 down. And six in the middle, two, three, four, five, six. Now we need to make the curve parts of our letter. Oops. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. And add just a little bit in here so that way we can have a fuller shape when we flat ice it. And then one, two, three, four, five. And there we go. So we have a little bit more room to discuss on the top of it. We can do our happy birthday or whatever you want to put in the block. That's why we try to make a, a kind of a block in the middle of the cupcake cake so we do have place for an inscription. So there we go, the letter B with 24 cupcakes. Alright you guys, thanks so much for hanging out with me. I will see you in the next letter. Okay, let's get on with the letter C. It's just so much easier on my phone. So this is what the letter C looks like in the cupcake liners. It takes 24 cupcakes and to get started I am going to do the 6 down the side and then the 3 along the bottom and then we're going to shape the rest after that. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3. Now we also have four up at the top to make that top curve. Two, three, four. There we go. Now at this point we could leave it like that, but that's a very skinny, very boring C and it does not have very many cupcakes on it because we want to feed everybody. You can always make this small, the letter smaller if you have fewer cupcakes that you need. So, and then on the inside, we're just going to place them in like the little crooks and elbows. Remember how those cupcakes are a bit squishy, so you have that factor um, to play a little bit more where you don't so much with the, uh, the liners that you template with. So, I mean, ultimately, you want as little gapping as possible because it's going to use up more icing for you. Okay. 
Okay, so I added an extra one down here and here to make 24. So this is the letter C. Now this is ready to be tacked down and flat iced. Thank you so much for hanging out here with me and I will see you later on in the alphabet. Okay, let's have a look at the letter D on my magic phone here. So this letter D takes 22 cupcakes. I'm going to start with the six on the outside and then go into the six in the middle of the crooks here and then work my way around on the loop. Two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now we're going to get ready to do 10 all the way around this loop. Or 9 all the way around the loop. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Alright. Sometimes if your cupcakes are a little small, you can even get an extra one in there. Look at that. Alright, so there we go. Letter D. Remember, you want to keep a little bit of a space where you can do an inscription if you want to because you don't want the whole thing to be too skinny. And this letter takes, well now, 23 cupcakes. Thanks so much for hanging out and I will see you in the next letter. Alright, let's have a look at how to make letter E. Nero. So here we go. The letter E is very easy. It's almost like three little lines, but it's you know three little lines in a triangle. So we're going to start off with doing the two rows of four up top, and then we'll take it back down to add the five, and then finish off with the block of three, and then the triangle. It sounds more confusing than what it really is, but when it comes to decorating, you want to keep... The, um, keep it simple, so keep the blocks together so you're able to visualize what it is you want to do with your cake. So now we're going to add five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to add another block of six. Two, four, Six, and then a triangle of three. So you're going to stick these two in the nooks and right there. There we go. A beautiful letter E. I am doing these cupcakes half and all half chocolate just to give you a different effect and it helps to visualize the blocks as well. But you can do whatever flavors cupcake that you want. Thanks so much for hanging out. I'll see you in the next letter. Okay, let's have a look at the letter F. This takes 24 cupcakes. Where is my magic thing here? All right, so this is a very, very straightforward and basic letter to do. I'm gonna start off with the two rows of seven, move into the six, oop, move into the six block, and then move into the four block. So let's have a look at this. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, line those all up. That looks good. Oh, and then a block of six. There's four. And two more. There's six, and then a block of four right in the middle. There we go. There is the letter F. Kind of quick and easy. Remember with uh, cupcake cakes you want to leave enough room for an inscription somewhere along the way or for other decorations because these are really fun to decorate. Thanks so much for hanging out with me in the alphabet and I'll see you in the next letter. Alright, let's have a look at the letter G. G, this is fun. 
So the letter G takes 24 cupcakes, and this is kind of an awkward one as it goes around, and if you notice there's a bit of a gap there between there and there, it's because we want to give that G the whole, give its little crook there, its own little space, so I'll explain that as we're putting it down. There really isn't kind of an easy way to start this, so I'm going to start probably down the side here, two, four, with five down the side here. There's our five down the side. One, two, three, four, five. Now I'm going to look into the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven that go around the loop. You're just going to have to make that loop really big. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now I'm going to add the four at the top. One, two, three, four. Okay, and the rest of it is just going to kind of be tucked into the corners all the way around. So with this letter, you just basically want a good outline, and then you just kind of want to fill it in with the rest of your cupcakes. This is the part we're having them in the cupcakes versus having just the uh, cupcake liners out is a little bit different. But you can see we've got that G spot there, right? So it comes around and then you've got your separate line that divides the letter G. So there we go. That looks not bad. Alright you guys, thanks for hanging out with me. I will see you later on in the alphabet. Okay, let's have a look at the letter H. This is a simple cupcake cake with 20 cupcakes. There we go. So I'm going to start off this one by doing the outside edges. So I've got seven up each side and then a block of six in the middle. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now make sure you do placement testing with your cupcakes first. Um, that way you get them in the right spot before you tack them down. So there it is. And let's do a block of six in the middle. I like adding my middle blocks kind of in the elbows and the crooks of the letter. So there we go, the letter H, done with 20 cupcakes. Please feel free to click the boxes around this letter to go back to the cupcake playlist and for all the other letters, or click the i cards to take you to the how to tack down your cupcakes video and the demo for how to flat ice the pull apart cake. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, and I'll see you later on in the alphabet. Oh, this one was really quick. You can do your inscription there.